What's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. Uh, I want to start this video off that um, we, I got some new tires for the Tundra. Um, they're not mounted yet. They're in the bed here. I want to show you guys uh, kind of initial uh, first impressions of my uh, Nitto Exo Grappler. So if you recall my other videos, I have these on my truck already. Um, there's the new tires. I have them on my truck already, you can see here. I went with the same ones again. Um, I did want to upsize, but uh, due to COVID, I had a hard time finding the 35 by 11 and a half size. So I ended up going with the 275, 65R20 again, which is what I have on the truck now. So let me uh, get up in the bed and I'll show you guys what they are. All right guys, up here in the Tundra, I'll show you the nice tread, look at these. Um, for those of you that don't know, the Nitto Exagrapplers are three peak mountain snowflake rated, which is right there, and they're studdable. So you can see there's a stud, every other one, there's a stud on every one, it interchanges those, so they're there. So. So yeah, so the size I got, let me see if I can get you here, right here, 275, 65, R20. Um, you can see 10 ply, 34 by 10 and a half. Now on their website, it says 34.33 uh, by like 10.98 or something. So, so there's that. <clears throat> Here's the tag. Show you guys. So you can see again the Snowflake Mountain Rated. Uh, brand new, these have 18.4 uh, uh, 30 seconds of tread depth. You can see how deep those are. Almost my whole finger, or top part of my finger there. Uh, you can see the siping, which makes these good snow tires. Uh, you can see their, um, the blocks are scalloped. So this one's uh, scalped in, this one's out, scalped in. Which is nice. And then I think they have a really aggressive sidewall. Let's see if which one I want to show you guys. I think this is the sidewall. There's two different ones. This one's more aggressive, I believe. And then this one is the other sidewall you can choose from. So, anyways, guys, excited. Like I said, um, I've been looking for tires here. You can hear Winston. He's down there. Anyway, guys, I've been looking for tires um, for a while. Um, my current tires still have, you know, 7 to 8, 30 seconds left on the tread depth. So, not like I needed to replace them urgently. But, um, I kind of wanted to get them before it started snowing here in Missouri. So, I tried to find the 35 by 11 and a half R20s. Couldn't find those anywhere in stock. Uh, and if they were in stock, the prices were like stupid inflated. It was not even worth it. So then I kept looking for 285, 65R20s. Again, same thing. You know, either weren't in stock or the prices were inflated. So I finally found, I said a 275, 65R20s, um, literally for the same price I paid five years ago. Um, about three... About three hundred dollars a tire, so not bad uh, for a set of you know twenty inch wheels, thirty fours for a truck. So extremely happy. Um, I'm be happy to do another noise video for you guys, uh, highway drive with these brand new tires, so you can compare them to my uh, tires that I have now that I've had for five years, fifty thousand miles. I have seven thirty seconds left and a slight cupping, so. Yeah. One more look at these tires here. Let me just look at that. Look how deep those are. Beautiful. Hey guys, I just want to show you my current tires. My yeah, my current tires here again. Um, as you can see. 
275, Exo Grappler, WT, 34 by 10 and a half, Snowflake rated. Um, there's the current tread. You can see I'll put my finger in there. Um, so yeah, it's 50,000 miles on these things. Love it. Want to make sure I showed you guys, made in USA. Um, all Mendoza's have been made in the USA. I think they're made down in Georgia. So, supporting that local economy. Guys, that was just a quick video of my new tires I got and my story of what, why I picked this size again. Um, it's just due to availability, end of the year, COVID. So, um, look forward to my new videos, guys. I'm gonna make new videos about these, highway driving. Um, I'll keep y'all updated on the wear and everything. Um, but yeah, guys, I'm excited. I'm excited. So if you like what I'm doing on the channel, please think about subscribing. Uh, if, if you're excited to see these tires, not many people on YouTube have these tires, or in general. Uh, not many people I know of even know of these tires. So um, give me a thumbs up if you like these tires, and let me know in the comments what you think. Um, should I want something else? What do you What do you use on your truck? So appreciate you guys uh, checking me out. Appreciate the support. Have a great night.